Oh, look, we're starting the episode. Um, wait, weren't we already here? Yeah, I went back and checked out them fishermen. And the ones in Kalos are hotter, I'll just say that. But look at this shady business. Oh, I do like to have this tasty, nutritious slowpoke tail. So this is the saboteur who's been selling slowpoke tails. How barbaric, and I don't know which is more barbaric, the act of chopping off slowpoke tails and selling them for nutritional value, or sell that price they're selling them for. How repulsive. And then he's just like, go scram and shoot. Wait, I wonder what happens if I say yes, I'll pay that reduce. I thought kids these days were loaded, and what made you think that? On to the actual content of the episode in three, two, one. Hello, hi, and welcome. Yeah, I already did a little intro, I guess, to this video, but it is episode six of my little Let's Play Pokemon Soul Silver um, video. Yep, that's where I was going for. So Team Rocket has invaded Azalea Town. That's where we have left off. You know about Slowpoke Tail? Yes, I do, and I am not amused. Aren't you glad I told you that? No, because it makes me think even less of you than I already did. Which was already pretty low. I'm so mad I'm just gonna pick this apricorn tree without asking the owner. Ugh. And it's a white one, too. I bet that's just a great one to have. What's in this house, anyway? I think this is Kurt's house. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Hi, little girl. How are you? The Snowpoke are gone. Were they taken away by bad people? Yes, very bad people. I won't. I will spare you the details. Who are you? Okie, okay, eh? You want me to take make some balls? Sorry, but they'll have to wait. Do you know Team Rocket? Oh, don't worry. I'll tell you anyhow. Hey, I know them. Team Rocket's an evil gang that uses Pokemon for their dirty work. They're supposed to have to spend it three years ago. Yeah. Anyway, that the well, cutting off slowpoke tails for sale. I like how slowpoke tails are all one word. Okay, so that was Kurt. And let's see how Centric feels about this. He feels happy about this? Okay, that makes me a little concerned about Centric's mental health. But I'm just going to assume that he's just happy because he loves me and we're spending time together. We have this tough guy called Kurt. He should be able to take care of it. Yes, he is going to. I just spoke with him. Okay, neither Kurt nor the, um, <clears throat> nor the person who is guarding this area are to be seen. What is a boy to do but go in after them, assuming that at least one of them is down here. Slowpoke, well, I bet there are slowpoke down here. Hey there, okay. The guard up there took off when I shouted at him. But then I took a tumble down the well. I slammed down hard on my back so I can't move. Rats! Yes, yeah, super tough indeed. Just kidding. Not hurt anybody. <sighs> okay. Show them. Oh yeah, sure. I'll do your dirty work for you since you messed up. That makes complete sense and sounds completely fair. Ah! Humph! I was standing guard up top when this old coot yelled at me. He stood up me, so what should I fell down here? Ooh. Why would you tell why would you tell somebody that before you're about to battle them? Wouldn't you be embarrassed? Because I'm a little embarrassed for you, sir. With all due respect. Oh, just kidding. Who am I kidding? I don't have any respect for you. Okay. It's a battle of the fairly basic normal type. Centret, I think you got this girl. Even if Rattata's tail whips you. You already took over a third of its HP. Take away the other two thirds. Ooh, with a critical hit? Yes. <gasps> Whoa! Does that actually ever happen? Oh, I should call critical hits more often. S sorry, I just started thinking about all the weirdos who might call me on my poke gear. Ugh. Ugh. Anyway. Centric, you did a good job, but let's give somebody else a chance. And they're giving Team Rattata, or Team Rattata, Team Rocket members Rattata. I remember, uh, that's funny. They must be the gruntiest of the grunts, these people. Alright, Ben, give him a good Gustin. Give him a Gustin. That's a person's name. 
All right, give him another Gustin. Mm. Okay, good on you getting a critical hit that you couldn't have just done it the first time and whatever. It's okay, Ben. I still love you. <laughs> oh, this is, it really isn't your day. It sucks. That's your punishment for being a ginger. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Oh my gosh, the female grunts have pink hair. This is wild and outlandish. Actually, I could just go around here. Ah, wild Pokemon! Is it a slow- nope, it's a Zubat. Well, of course, why wouldn't it be a Zubat? You viewers did not see it, but I just gave the computer a very nasty look. Oh, and another one, because I can't escape, really? Ugh. Of course, I can never escape the Zubats in these darn caves. Okay. Alright, let me get this ball before I have to face you, girl grunt person. Yay, a super potion! I might need that. Ah! Stop taking slower tails! What you want is to distribute it from Executive Proton. <laughs> That's his name? Oh gosh. What has become of Team Rocket? They've just gone on in all sorts of weird directions without Giovanni. This whole part of the game is too lengthy. You rotten brat. Girl, I showered today. Can't say the same from you from the smells of it. Okay, obviously... Never mind. I was going to say what I was thinking out loud, but then it was pointless. Another super potion. Nice. My Pokemon are going to be the most well-heeled Pokemon on the block. Hello. Does he have pink hair too? I'm so confused. Okay, so he says that Team Rocket's reputation would be ruined if they stopped taking Slowpoke Tails. What kind of reputation are they going for? Because I feel like the lowest of the low is how I would classify people who take that. Is that really... I mean, I know they're the bad guys, but wouldn't they want to be known for being competent at least, instead of just gross? I mean, it doesn't take that much competence to cut off the tails of innocent Pokemon. It just takes a lack of a soul. And I disapprove. Ugh. Huh, I do approve of its supersonic missing, though, because that would be a real pain. Yeah, you can leech life, that's fine. Because I'll lose all of 2 HP. Yeah, enjoy the 1 HP you got from that, you damn fool. Mm-hmm. I should probably use somebody up there in Sentra in this next battle. Ooh, you want to learn Fury Swipes? <laughs> well, don't let me stop you. Look at Scratch, it's like this basic version of Fury Swipes. Look at you. You go, Sentra. Let's see, I haven't used Cindy much these days. It's only two levels above the rest of my party, so let's let it. Let Cindy come out to play. Oh, I'm a little, I'm a little astonished, not by the move, but the, by the fact that that Zubat survived that Ember. Not that Ember is a super powerful attack, but oh, anyway, look at how close Cindy is to leveling up. Question is, how s close is Cindy to um, having a new nickname? Okay, sorry, this is me failing to switch the Pokemon I meant to switch. Still, that's still not who I wanted in front, but we'll go with it. Why not? Ben's a nice girl. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, Ben. This might be Executive Proton. Are you ready for this? A slowpoke with its tail cut off? Yes, I want to read the mail. Be good and look after the house with Grandpa and Slowpoke. Love, Dad. I feel like that slowpoke belonged to somebody. This makes me want to cry. Okay, oh my gosh, this is sick. I'm disgusted. I feel like crying. Proton! Oh wait, why would he say his own name in that? Like, what, what do we have here? Hi, I'm often labeled as the scariest and cruelest guy in Team Rocket. I strongly urge you not to interfere with our business. 
and your business is what exactly? Alright, he looks less elderly in that close-up than he did in his um, overworld sprite. So good for you, Proton. No, really. Who's who else is in Team Rocket now? Executive Neutron and Electron. <gasps> Lord have mercy. Oh no, Supersonic, and it worked. Oh, and it really worked. Ouch. Now that I now I see what he means by saying he's the scariest rocket person. So far, anyway, I'm sure there'll be worse um, rocketeers out there. Ben, are you? Come on, Ben, you're killing me here. All right, I'm gonna take a risk and hope that it um, overcomes its confusion. <laughs> nope. Oh, bye, Ben. You, you you put forth a good effort there. <sighs> okay, center it. It's up to you. Gosh, I don't think I have access to revives at this point in the game. It's too bad. I hoping to get some good level on up for the old Benny boy here, but it's all right. Then you'll be a Pidgeotto one of these days. Oh, I should have used Fury Swipes. That's like my new move. Centra, look at you gaining levels. All right, here, I'll give you an opportunity to use your Fury Swipes now. It doesn't matter where we go. There's always someone who doesn't agree with us. Yeah, because your stance is stupid. Gosh. So is that pose you're doing, by the way. I could pull that pose off way better is really what I'm saying. I don't know about these Fury Swipes. I feel like the Quick Attack might have been more powerful. But I haven't actually Quick Attacked this particular Pokemon, so I don't know. It's also at a much higher level than what I've been facing. Yes, I'm dead serious. I don't know if you noticed, but I'm beating you. Well, granted that um, I've only knocked out one of your Pokemon, and I'll have lost my second. But I have more in reserve. So, yeah. Beedrill, who is who I meant to um, lead with. You can finish him off. Oh yeah, duh, you have a Fury Attack. Hmm. There you go. That's how a multi-hit attack will work. Help when they're down to very low HP. Her for a kid to be this good. I didn't see it coming. Yeah, well, I didn't see your idiocy coming, and yet. Team Rocket was indeed broken up three years ago, but we continued our activities underground. A small obstacle like you won't be too much of a problem for our mission. I advise you to be very afraid of what's to come. Yeah, I am. I hope what's to come is a new hairstyle for you. Oh, hey, Kurt. Way to go, Wokey! Team Rocket has taken off! My back's better too, let's get out of here. Oh good, I did. I'm glad I didn't have to actually walk out myself. You handle yourself like a real hero. As I mentioned before, Team Rocket was disbanded by a boy called Red. Oh, Red! Hi, Red! Three years ago. Now that they have come back, I have a bad feeling about it. And anyway, please be greatly pleased to build by a trainer like you. <laughs> that is all I have now, but take it! A fastball. Yeah, I found for coins for me. Fine, I'll turn them into Pokeballs. Here, take my black balls. Ah, that's right, I'll give you my grandpa's number. Okay, he's somebody I, whose number would be useful, so I'll take it. Who's Anthony? Is that that hiker? Sup, this is Anthony, how are you? The other day I was watching my mashup eat some berries. It looked like it was enjoying its meal, so I decided to try some. I'm not sure people should eat that stuff. Well that was mildly entertaining, so I won't I won't disown you, Anthony. Alright, so I have vanquished Team Rocket, and I have gone to the Pokemon Center, and I have healed my Pokemon, is what I will be able to say in moments. So I think, I don't know how long this video's been, actually. Let's see. I feel like, what else happens in Azalea Town? Anybody? Bueller? Ben is feeling better, so you decided to take Ben with you. Okay, we're going to lead with Beedrill, because he's just a level behind the rest of the gang. And because he's just beautiful. I want to talk to a Slowpoke with its tail on its back. I mean, what a novel idea, right? Slowpoke, 
Dot dot dot. Jan? I'm Ron Burgundy? Okay. So, here's the gem. I'm not gonna face it in this episode, but let's take a look and see if there's any weird obstacles that'll stop me from- Yo, Challenger! Bugsy made this gem! It's a huge nest of bug-type Pokémon. Bugsy's young, but he's a master of bug-type Pokémon. Thanks, guy. I knew that already. Um... Okay, um... So, here's... I'm gonna leave you all with a question. Which is, who in the world names their child Bugsy? If you can answer me that, then I'll upload the next episode. Okay, on that note, I think this ended quite similarly to the last episode, which is me running around aimlessly Azalea Town. But this time, it's without Team Rocket. Yay! See, there's not that guy guarding the gym. Yeah, so on that note, I will say bye, and I'll see ya later.